is about depression. Let's talk about our best, worst companion. Hmm? It's not a friend, is it? It's the desperate, tragic feeling that something is invariably wrong. Even when you're happy, depression creeps in and tells you that you're not. We must persist through depression. Our problems can not defeat us. The average daily load of suffering will not break you and I. We will not give up. If we go back a video or two, we get to not give up. We get to continue. We get to keep growing stronger. You and I get to continue. There are many that don't get to make it out of today. Not that infinite rolling now, but today on a calendar. There are people, no guilt on you, no shame, who won't make it out of today, who would give anything to keep going. And then there are people, like I once was, like you may be feeling right now, who wish for death, or at the very least, a cease of the ride, a break. From the pain to gain our bearings, take a breath, ungrit our teeth. We must continue. We must go on. You. I see a lot of vague donate profiles following me, and I'm thankful for that. That means the world. That means the inner you that doesn't want a profile picture or a name wants to be here. Thank you. Perhaps that means you're ashamed to be here, and I'm sorry that you feel that way. I'm not ashamed that you're here. I am grateful. I am honored that you are here. For the people with pictures and names, thank you for coming to say, yeah, in my web history is this weird fellow who talks certain things that mean something. God bless you for letting me mean something to you. Depression. These are more marching orders than a talk about psychological effects. You can look up all that stuff elsewhere. I can tell you, though, as someone who's lost my whole mind, and who's crawling back to a life that almost resembles something like normal through a looking glass darkly. You can come back from going all the way away. There is beauty in that victory moment by moment, tiny savory bits of hope, of joy. I do have to fight for joy moment by moment. By moment, I'm the, the worst hand model. We must fight for joy. Moment by moment by moment. It is our duty that we can accept or reject to keep on. We can keep on. Even if it feels like we can't, we can keep on. If only you shut your eyes and go to sleep. Perhaps that will give you just an ounce of strength for tomorrow. Or if you think if you go to sleep, you'll wish you never woke up. Continuing that cycle of believing that sleep is the solution, thus death is the eternal sleep, that might be the solution? No. No. Some people have to stay up for an extra hour, be tired at work the next day even though they're already exhausted, but they have to get a breath. They have to watch their favorite show or eat a snack, make a snack, look at the moon. There are so many simple, free ways to find a reason to keep going. For me, it's faith-based, and I'll put this at the end, in case you haven't already flicked away. Jesus loves you, and he is at your door 24-7. Except for the door is literally anywhere you wish to open up. Jesus is my reason for keeping going. And there's my wife, which I am blessed to have. I know so many marriages are on fire or sunken, and mine remains, even though I lost my mind. I am honored by my wife. My children are interesting and tricky and beautiful and hard, but they are mine. They are not a reason to leave this life. They are a reason to stay. I got a best friend, one. He's not here every day but he's always a call away, you know what I mean? I got a couple of other friends who are probably one call away, maybe. We haven't bonded like that. They are friends and they are valuable. 
I keep wanting to go back to honesty because that's how you make real friends. You get emotionally naked and you say, this is me. And you hope that they are emotionally capable enough to do the same. This prevents depression. This stabs at the heart of the snake. And it's tricky to stab a heart of a snake because they got nothing but ribs. A friend who has a joke on hand can stab at the heart of that depression snake. A romantic interest might cause as much pain as help, but eventually, God bless them, there is one for you. I believe in soulmates because I prayed on a bathroom floor for a girl that would save me from myself. And 48 hours later, I got a message on MySpace, old school, one sentence, but it was enough. I knew that moment could happen tomorrow for you. You just have to hang on. Faith relationships. What about work? Yeah, there's a million jobs out there that don't mean much. And maybe it's not about what the job does for you. It's about what you get to do for others through the job. And I know that sounds helping others. I am depressed. I know. I hear you. Having a job in some ways is a gift just because it gives you something to keep you moving. People that get real depressed or real lost. People that both lose their minds and win the lottery. Both lose purpose. If your job is hell, your purpose could be to find another one where you get to help people all the time. And that beauty of doing that is just this far, but you have to keep going. You have to sidestep or peer away, away from the snake of depression. And if it already has a hold of you, you need help. You need people. You need community of some kind. They're out there. And there's one right here. Look in the comments for the suicide video. Look in the comments of a few of the other videos. There are kind people like you here now. I wanted my website to be this type of community to keep it kind of in a quiet corner on the internet. YouTube is a bit busier, but there is an option for community here too. I am one for you. Do not give up. I'm wearing a hoodie and my air conditioning is off for you. I'm a bigger fella and I'm sweating for you. Now family, I am new to this concept. Family against depression for me. Both my parents are gone. My brother is gone. But I have my wife and children. They are now my family. And though they are imperfect and I am imperfect, we suffer together to grow together towards Christ as we believe that to be the purpose of our existence. And because we have that faith, her family is kind and beautiful and we agree and we love towards Christ together. And we all believe in the same faith direction. It is stunning. I am honored. They are not my born family, but they are family. The dogs just went crazy. It means I have to go. Know that you are loved. Don't you dare give up. We don't have to give up. We don't have to give up. We don't have to give up. Not now. We got a few more rounds in us, don't we? Tell me. Whisper if you have to. Tell me. We have a few more fights. Keep fighting with me. Stay. God, please bless the people that have watched this, and please hang on to them, hug them, love them. In your holy name, I pray, God, bless them, keep them safe. Show them your love if you have the perfect sun ray, a way to love them, a way to help them, a way to encourage them. God, please bless these people. Even if they don't know you, if they don't believe, God, please shine your light on them. Today, tomorrow, please, God, I beg you in your own.